I first met Suge in maybe like 91, you know, one of the biggest, uh, most important uh, groundbreaking covers of the Source magazine was the photo of Dr. Dre with the gun to his head that came out uh, several months before the chronic dropped. So uh, I had gotten an advanced tape of the chronic and I was riding around in New York listening to it. I'm like, man, this is going to be a game changer. This is incredible. I ended up tracking down Suge, flew out to L.A. to go meet him and convinced him to give us the exclusive interview with Dre. Um, and, you know, that was, you know, that was an incredible cover. It helped take the source to another level. It helped really stamp the chronic, you know, a month or two before it dropped, you know, to, to you know, so that's, that's where it all started. And we've just been cool ever since. Um, I think people are going to be really, really interested when we drop the uh, visual version on YouTube. I think these are really new and innovative uh, uh, things on the visual side. Um, using some some AI and some things to to really make it look amazing. I don't want people to necessarily get the wrong impression. You know, the first episode he had some things that he felt he needed to get off his chest, and so you're you're hearing a lot of that stuff. You know, that's part of the the first episode. But even within the first episode, you're going to be hearing you know much more detailed stories about many things. You know, um, both historic and 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 present day. You know, he was ahead of his time in terms of you know his business ideas for the you know how how to make the music industry and hip hop more more fair and more equitable and giving people what they deserve and you know many things like that he uh, he can share. Um, and and you know he's up on what's going on out here in the world right now. You know, it's not like he's far removed and doesn't know. So he has a lot of, you know, ideas and, and, and views on different things. So, you know, the goal, again, is to do something that's not going to be, you know, just him talking a bunch of shit about people. You know, we're going to get that out of the way. Then we're going to get into creating something that can, uh, you know, that can inspire people, that can open their minds up. Uh, credible, you know, conversations, some of the conversations I envision him having with certain people, you know, could be just so historic. You know, we can't talk about the 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 uh, death of Tupac and Biggie Smalls without talking about the, you know, law enforcement and other forces that, that you know, were involved, in my opinion, uh, were, were most certainly involved in uh, contributing to those things. So, um, you know, I think all the way up to his current case. I mean, you know, I don't know all the facts surrounding his current case for being in prison, but when I heard about it, when I saw it, I mean, it looks like self-defense to me. He'll, he'll talk about it in the podcast. I think he believed that he could have beat that case but with all the the odds stacked against him, they've been trying to put this man down for forever, you know. And they did it once and got him out of the way for a few years, and you know now they're 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 hoping that they can you know keep him uh, you know for the rest of his life um, in prison. But uh, you know, just like this podcast is, is popping up on people, don't don't be surprised if he if he ends up popping up one of these days. You know, I don't know him to be uh, a liar. I don't, you know, this man is in prison. He's been locked up for, you know, almost nine years. Uh, he's had a lot of time to to think and to get himself into the space that he's in now. Um, so I just don't see, you know, him being up there just making up shit or whatever. Uh, the boogeyman of hip hop is back. You better be scared uh, because Suge Knight is back uh, launching collect calls on Halloween 2023.